It is pretty beautiful, isn't it? So we can see that, you know, Xiaomi have prepared us the another flag model, which is Xiaomi 14 Ultra. And from what I see, obviously, the premiere in Europe will be happening uh, at the 25th uh, of the February at 2 p.m. GMT at Barcelona. And, um, you know, obviously that's a pretty cool um, kind of thing. We don't see much more on the um, website except the footage which, which I just showed you. But uh, what I wanted to show you a sneak peek and a kind of bit of a more spec if you haven't followed the Xiaomi kind of launch and all the rumors. Because uh, what Xiaomi also did, they already premiered in China. So because of it, we can actually have a bit of a more information on the Chinese website if your Chinese is, you know, fluent. <laughs> But obviously what I did, I used the Google Translator to show you the details. We're looking at the 5300 milliampere hours capacity, which I think it's, you know, great for such a phone. And we're also looking at the 90 watt um, wired uh, charger and 80 watt wireless second charge. So we're looking at the Snapdragon 8, it's the RPDDR5X with plus 32% CPU overall performance and plus 34% with the GPU performance but also obviously you know following with what Samsung have recently um, have created we're looking at the 98% of the AA performance. So when it comes to the screen we're looking at the 2K um, screen with the 3200 by 1440 resolution with 522 ppi and the C8 luminous and material professional eye protection screen which means it'll be brighter and have a more energy saving capabilities. We're also looking at the 12-bit color depth with up to 120 Hz adaptive refresh rate which will make the phone working extremely smooth and I think it will also look pretty great in the sunlight. Um, I want to just look at the you know special edition which is titanium special edition. I think it looks pretty amazing. You can see the details. Wow it's just like it's the phone which um, in a way, it will be, I have a feeling I can't wait to actually have it in my hands and see how it looks, but the finish of it, like, it's pretty amazing. We can see a huge space for the camera from Leica, as uh, obviously they're looking into, you know, a very professional um, cameras right now. And within that, I think it will be pretty decent, also that kind of almost like a leather finish, which, you know, it will probably hold the phone in your hand much better. So let's dig into those cameras, because obviously um, Leica will have a quad camera with the full focal range and large aperture. So we're looking at the four different cameras. The main one will be um, the um, 50 megapixel Sonus LYT900 sensor with f163 focus to uh, 4.0 stepless variable aperture. Um, it will also have the Hyper iOS, um, OI, sorry, OIS, uh, super optical image stabilization. So that, that probably will make those beautiful images which we just saw and um, 50, 75 mm, second camera 75 millimeter Leica float, floating telephoto similar 50 megapixel we're also looking at the 75 uh, millimeter equi uh, equivalent focal length and 10 centimeter focusing distance with also OIS and optical image stabilization um, and Another which will be the low distortion wide angle, 122 um, angle, um, 120 degrees with 50 million pixels and 12 millimeter equivalent focal length and 5 centimeter super macro. And the fourth camera will be the 120 millimeter Leica close up telephoto with the 2.5 large aperture, 120 millimeter equivalent focal length and 30 centimeter focusing distance with also optical image stabilization. So we're looking at the putting a beautiful cameras inside of those. Um, and the image of course will be pretty great. Actually, this is the video which they showed um, on the um, website as well with, you know, a great footage. Let's grab a look. Pretty great.
great, right? It's, you know, this 20-30 seconds video which showed that guy how, um, you know, those those photos, the quality, the crispiness. Like, I think, you know, this is definitely, when, when you compare those um, spec to, you know, Oppo or um, Samsung, it's beautiful. Obviously, it's not 200 megapixel cameras, but let's be honest, the, the pixels are not everything. It's also about the... Uh, you know so many different things um, but we'll see how it actually looks so um, like when you actually look at the footages it's pretty amazing like it looks you know it looks like it's almost done by DSLR but um, you know they're actually showing what kind of aperture they used in kind of like how did it work with the you know size I think it's you know it it's showing that this is a phone which is actually based for making amazing images and grabbing ama amazing videos and I think this is kind of the way that people will want to go forward. So this is it for me, just wanted to give you a sneak uh, peek uh, preview before the actual um, Xiaomi will uh, launch. I love the um, kind of things that Xiaomi always put um, a pretty big charger so that means you know you can charge it very quickly without uh, issues and now with the beautiful camera uh, you know it will be pretty amazing. So this is it for me. I hope you enjoyed that short video. If yes, you know what to do, just hit that like and subscribe so you are up to date with everything what's going on in this brand new Mad Tech Tech channel and see you in the next video. Take care. Cut. Mom, I can't talk right now. Talk later. Stand by. Ready. Action.